It's a hard question. So absolutely they can, doesn't always mean that they should. So I've got a, a very diverse background. I've worked in retail, in media, in financial services, and I've never been that concerned with the specifics. But that only works if I'm surrounded by subject matter experts and the value I'm giving is to ask the right questions and help them shake things up. It's very difficult if you're a small company in a regulated environment and you bring someone who has no idea of who the customers are, what the problems are, what the terminology is, and what the regulatory environment is. Um, so yes, you absolutely can. You have to be open to adapt and you shouldn't be the only product person if you're changing that radically. Um, but you can really help round out a team and change somebody who's been very insular and help them look at, uh, consider new ways of doing things. The jump between B2B and B2C can be really difficult. There are certain uh, customer segments that are incredibly difficult to identify with and get the empathy for, and those can be really tough ones. But for the most part, being able to bring the advantage of your background and apply it in a different area, look at things through a slightly different lens, ask really good questions, and be willing to learn, it's an absolutely fantastic opportunity. If everyone's asking the same questions, then you're not gonna do anything groundbreaking or new. Probably actually the best thing I've ever read about product management is by an American t television writer and it's, he calls it his 11 laws of show running. And the parallels between writing a TV series and working with uh, other parts of the company and how you plan out strategy and communicate are uncanny and incredibly valuable.